Are you all, are you all content? Do you understand what you're voting for? Yeah. Yeah. Right, okay. In that case, Councillor Fry, uh, if you you put it forward, you propose the motion, and Councillor Holcroft is seconded with it, in which case I will now, if everybody's happy, you go forward to the recorded vote. Yes. Yeah, no, I'll, I'll do it. Uh, I'm going to read it out, uh, Jim, and then Councillor Bean is going to. Please, yes, going through? Oh, All right. He's been promoted. Are we ready? Oh, yes, absolutely. So, Councillor Amos is sadly absent. So, the first councillor on my list is Councillor Bird. Councillor Block. Councillor Bloomfield. Against. Councillor Blondell. Four. Councillor Bond. Abstain. Councillor Burrows. Four. Councillor Coleman. Four. Councillor Cooper. Four. Councillor Deacon. Against. Councillor Dunk. Four. Councillor Fisher. Against. Councillor Fryatt. Four. Four. Councillor Gallant. Four. Councillor Gita. Four. Councillor Gallant. Against. Councillor Green. Four. Councillor Harvey. Four. Councillor Harvey. Against. Okay. Councillor Hal Cole. Four. Councillor Hitchman. Four. Councillor Holbrook. Four. Councillor Hudson. Against. Councillor Jones. Four. Councillor Gelso. Against. Councillor Kerry. Against. Councillor Lawson. Four. Councillor Lynch. Four. Councillor Moore. Four. Councillor Mulcahy. Four. Councillor Newton. Four. Councillor Savage. Four. Councillor Smith. Four. Councillor Yo. Four. Thank you very much, members. Give us a little bit of time. We are fine about the evening. I'd like to announce the result of the vote. Thank you very much. I have the result of the vote. Four is 23, against 8, abstentions 2. And that's the total of 33 councillors. The motion is now carried. Hi, long time no see. Um, we're currently uh, entering into a sort of final phase of public consultation on the North Felixstowe Garden neighbourhood uh, scheme and um, what I wanted to do to today is to share with you where we've got to, how we got there and what we could do going from this point. So basically um, the Suffolk Coastal Local Plan was adopted finally on the 23rd of September 2020 and prior to that plan being adopted a landowner in Felixstowe put forward some land that was not a part of the um, housing schemes that had been previously agreed and it was the land on which Trelawney place is now being built. You may have noticed it as you come in sort of um, towards cow pasture allotments and the garrison lane roundabout. And it would appear that back in, I think it was about 2018, which is a fair time ago, isn't it? Under the previous Conservative administration, um, because the previous plan apparently didn't have enough land allocation. Uh, the appeal from the landowner to the Secretary of State, Savid Javid, was allowed uh, to build, I believe, 560 dwellings on the land that they own, which is actually smack in the middle of the North Felixstowe Garden Neighbourhood Scheme. So, if you like, this has been in the works for a very long time. Uh, the local plan was agreed, and this was the one that was actually presented by the Conservative uh, administration. 
it was duly uh, held to account by the inspector, Inspector Phillips, at the uh, public inquiries of which went on for, oh, I don't know, uh, a couple of weeks. And at the end of it, um, this was ticked off. And the thing that was ticked off was the North Felix Stoke Garden neighbourhood. So where we are now is that all of the things that were proposed that it would do were agreed during that meeting um, or during those series of consultations. What um, really, I think, to a great degree does damage the North Felixstowe Garden neighbourhood is the fact that straight in the middle of it, I don't know whether you can actually see that, but perhaps Bernard could put it off as a slide at some point, is um, the fact that the land on which this scheme is considered is currently owned by three different landowners and we are waiting for them all to agree to a master plan and that particular hearing with the general public will be held and heard at Felixstowe School and it will be on Thursday the 7th of November and it will be held between the hours of 5.30 to 8 p.m. It will apparently take the form of a question time. There will be a panel and you will need to submit your questions prior to the uh, meeting taking place. It's not clear whether the panel will take further questions resulting from their responses to the questions that have been lodged. But clarification on that no doubt will come at some point. Uh, prior to the meeting on the 7th of November. So that updates you as to how we've got where we are, where we are, and uh, what will be happening on the 7th of November. Good to see you. See you again. Bye for now.